Hi, my name is Ponchi, and this video is going to show you how to remove and replace your monocoat film on your heat bed. Um, you can find a link on my website where to purchase this stuff if you're not using this right now. This stuff is much cheaper than, uh, you know, the uh, capped on tape, and it certainly works better than the uh, blue tape, and it's, you know, seamless. You can buy a, a big roll or something like this. Something like this for about uh, eleven dollars, and uh, if you go on their website, um, and there's a link to buy it, you know where to buy it, and um, you know I was able to find it uh, three miles here from my house, and there's a lot of locations, a lot of hobby stores that carry it. Uh, so anyhow, um, just raise your uh, z-axis up so it give you a little bit of clearance, and then just take a razor blade, and I've got the uh, bed heated up to about sixty right now. Just go to one of the corners and start lifting it up. It should peel right off. Now, because we're moving this bed quite a bit, we may want to check our calibration afterwards. So you can see it pulls up pretty easy. And what I do, I'll squirt it with a little bit of water. I'll take a sharp razor blade. Just make sure there's nothing, you know, none of the glues uh, left on the, on the glass bed because it'll, it'll cause problems when you go to put another one on. Okay. Squirt it again and wipe it off. You gotta be careful. It's, Bed's at 60, but that can still burn you. Okay. So now I've got a piece of Monaco here, and um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to peel off. There's a plastic film that you've got to peel off, and uh, where you peel it off, this is the side that you want to stick down on. And try not to get any dust or anything on it. And what I do is I'll wipe down the bed. This makes it so you can move this thing around fairly easily. So now I'll take film and put it on there, make sure it's covered, covers the whole bed. Try to get it as flat as possible. And then I'll just take a squeegee, something like this. You can buy these at Home Depot. Um, just start from the middle. Make sure you've got the whole thing covered. And the purpose of the water is so we can move this and get all those air pockets out. So I'll start from the middle and just, okay. I think I've got this thing on the back, yeah, I do. So, I'm sorry, looking at the camera, put it on upside down. Okay. I'll start from the middle and bring all that water and air pockets out to the edges. So this bed is still warm, so it's going to be evaporating the water and also heating up that glue so that it sticks to the bed. You can see that it's just, looks like it's not even on there. Don't worry about the edges too much right now because they may curl up or whatever, but uh, um, we're, we're going to cut it and then we're going to squeegee it down again and those edges will stick down once we turn the heat up a little bit. So what I'm doing, I'm just putting a straight edge. It's going to be a little bit off the edge of the glass. I go in about an eighth of an inch because you don't want those edges out there because it causes it to peel out.
tuck back. Now I'm going to take the squeegee again from the center. And squeegee that all out. Make sure there's no air pockets and all those edges are stuck down really well. Okay, now that's it. So now I'm going to turn the temperature up to about 100 and maybe I'll take the squeegee and squeegee down a little bit more. You've got to be very careful at that point because the bed will be very hot. And that's it. Thanks again and uh, please uh, take a look at some of my other videos.